WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida with your 1 p.m. update. Currently, we have all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the downside. The Dow's off 448, S&P's 46, NASDAQ 100, 169, Russell's 21, semis 40 points. The leader percentage-wise to the downside is the uh, transports. They're off 200 points. They're trading out at 14,770. Gold is up five bucks. Silver's up 29 cents. That's one and a quarter percent. Lights we crude up 238, two and six tenths percent. Natural gas up 15 pennies, that's three and a half percent. So we got commodities on the move to the upside. If we go take a look at our nine panel market update chart, we begin by taking a look at the ES Mini. The ES Mini is pulling back and testing support. Support is the bottom of its daily profile. That level is at 42.58. So far tested and rejected. It is. Uh, it can go lower. It has not tested the low in the ES Mini from the trading session of January 24th. That low would be 42.12.75. Now, close below that would spell major trouble or an A to B equals CD to the downside really is the better way to put it. But right now, prices are testing and so far has held support. ES, uh, we take a look at the spot volatility index. It's uh, trading above its 50-day exponential moving average. Always a bearish directional signal for the S&P 500. The NQ is testing the lows from January 24th. Today's close, very important, 13,706 if there's a close below that. That could be setting up large A to B equals CD to the downside. But support so far being tested. In the case of the U.S. dollar index, it's really just a sideways move. Not much to report out there. Gold is pretty much a sideways move. Yeah, it's up five bucks. Not a big deal out here. Should target the 1956 level. That's the A to B equals CD pattern to the upside. Silver's made its way up to that descending trend line. If it can clear this descending trend line, it's got another one above that. That above that would take you into about the $25-ish range out there. You're trading at 24.32. Look, Light Sweet Crude is up nicely. But uh, don't uh, let that, uh, well, don't let that tell you that it has not taken out resistance. Yeah, it's up. It's trading up at 92.44. But why hasn't it taken out the resistance of 93.83 set up by that Rhodes Mintum indicator signal? I don't know the answer to that question, but it is something for you and I to really consider. Gold not moving, really. Lightspeed crude not moving really hasn't taken out resistance. Uh, natural gas is up, traded up to the center of its daily profiles at the 363 level. And the 30-year Treasury, not really a flight to quality there. Price running into its descending trend line resistance level. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you're off to start your Tuesday, have a terrific one. We'll look forward to seeing you again soon. The reality is that navigating financial